Meaning of animus in dream. In simplest terms, animus represents the male aspects of a female psyche. It's everything customarily manly and oblivious around a female summed up in one picture. Enmity may be a woman's direct to absorbing manly characteristics and the manly rule, yang, and picking up to profound layers of the mind. She can be completely ladylike, moreover joining customarily manly characteristics. For an in-depth sea of manly characteristics in the yang, hostility can be the single most imperative dream character in a female's life since it's tied to an essential work of imagining, to assist in harmonizing and joining together the cognizant intellect with the oblivious mind. Animus is an original, a diagram for considering forms and behaviors, and originals emerge from the most profound layer of the mind, way exterior cognizant mindfulness for most individuals. The diagram is a diagram, and individual involvement with men, beginning with a woman's father or her to begin with imperative male parental figure, fills within the details. Animus can be a companion, direct, spouse, or darling, depending on what a lady needs and the nature of their relationship. And it's a relationship that endures a lifetime. A few dream characters come and go, but hostility is there from childhood to the conclusion. The shape he takes tends to be one that a female reacts to at anything a range of life she's in, and he can keep the same confront for a long time at a time. A lady knows her inward man on locate and feels him indeed when he's not displayed. He can be at her side at whatever point she needs or needs him. Animus tends to pop into a woman's dream life for a while, offer assistance to her with a few things, go on experiences together, deliver her the boost she needs, and after that go away for a whereas. And in ordinary ill will design, he'll be off doing a few masculine, critical things, at that point appear back up in her dreams at the correct time. The suggestion is that her ill will includes a life of his possession indeed when he's not in her dreams. Animus dream characters tend to alter frames and create over time, frequently reflecting a female's conception of a perfect man at that time of her life. During her childhood, he could be a father figure. Amid her young a long time, ill will is depicted as a man of activity, of muscle. He proceeds to advance through stages, the house husband sort, the teacher sort, the man of words and ideas, and on the off chance that all goes well he gets to be a sort of otherworldly direct, her possess individual Buddha or wise man, except apart more smoking. Enmity is distinctly alluring, but won't fundamentally be the foremost physically alluring male. It tends to appear more as an individual attraction, particularly as a lady matures. Additionally, they are distinguished by a feeling of near familiarity. Keeping a dream diary makes a difference in distinguishing them since they repeat, either as the same character or as a type of character. Anima figures tend to seem in men's dreams with a pivoting cluster of faces and shapes, though enmity figures tend to keep the same appearance for long extends. They can show up as males a female knows, as celebrities, competitors, and other popular guys who embody the role, and as totally non-existent characters. Animus enlivens a lady, no matter what stage of life she's in. When the relationship is sweet, she can be both completely female and comfortable acting manly, and her life will be filled with reason and zeal. When the relationship is awful, it's truly awful and appears, particularly in her mockery and feedback. She'll know precisely where to hit a man where it harms, and she can make ware of it. The firecrackers get serious when she befuddles her inward man with the man or men in her life. At that point it's a battle to the death, usually enthusiastic and mental passing, but in some cases physical, as well. Fireworks can be caused, as well, when a woman dreams almost ill will, her perfect internal man cherishes him, and considering it implies she intuitively wants to leave her mate. Her relationship with Animus is inside. She can have both a mate and hostility in her life, and she can cherish both similarly and differently. But she errs when she anticipates the men in her life to live up to the perfect appeared to her in her dreams. It's called ill will projection, and it's terrible news. A woman's shadow stands in the way of getting to her hostility in a good way. Shadow may be a gatekeeper at the gate to more profound get to her oblivious mind. Once Shadow is managed, Ill will get to be a steady partner and companion.